Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be wa watching five huge rocket explosions with my brother Chicken King. He has his YouTube channel. I'm going to leave it in the description. Yes, down below. And, and let's get right into it. Rocket technology has advanced rapidly over the last 60 years. And oh wait, I forgot to tell you guys, just please like and subscribe to the video and hit that bell so you can watch all my other videos. Peace. Time. It is estimated that over 35,000 <laughs> rockets have been sent to space. Okay, sorry Roger. about that. Such rapid no, look at so. no. You're bound to have Fine. some accidents. Space organizations spend years making sure everything is correct. However, a single error can cause those years of work to go down the drain well, in a matter of seconds. Uh, well, From the United States all the way to China, here are five rocket launches that went horribly wrong. I thought first it said five rock rocket launches. In October of 2014, NASA was set to launch an unmanned Antares rocket off the Virginia okay, coast. Okay. The goal was simple, to deliver goods to the International Space Station, something that had been done many, many times before. Unfortunately, things took a different turn that day. When the launch began, it was business as usual, but that didn't last for long. Why is it not going up? Oh no. I already see the bad stuff happening. Look at that. Um. Yeah, that wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, that- OH MY! There... I don't think I lied. Mm, yep, of course. I'm An investigation worried. into why the rocket failed soon followed. A year later, a report came out detailing how there was an explosion Engine within the rocket's rocket liquid explodes. oxygen turbo pump in one of the two Live AJ-26 engines. This caused the rocket to lose its thrust and come crashing back so close to the launch pad. The explosion was triggered when stationary and oh, rotating parts within the feet. turbo pump came into contact with That's one another. That, the excessive amount of friction These that was generated led to the incident. However, the report could not figure out what caused the issue in the turbo pump in the first place. Ice Angel. Investigators mm -hmm. narrowed it down to three potential issues, or perhaps some kind of combination of the three. It's possible the explosion occurred as a result of inadequate design robustness of the engine itself, which Why made it more susceptible you? to oxygen fires. Oh, it's also possible a debris um, such as titanium or silica you, got into the engine. Why are Finally, it right there, there could have been a manufacturing defect within the engine. Investigators could not say for explode. certain exactly what caused this disaster. Luckily, no one was harmed in this launch. How was no one harmed? No, oh, nobody harmed around of 2013, yeah. A Russian oh, rocket was, was set to take off. However, things no quickly went askew when the rocket began to veer off course. You can see in the video Wait, guys, how sorry about the ad. It's I have side, my ad block on. Hold. So, you don't have to watch ads. can only mean disaster. Okay. Hey. Everyone's so happy. Everyone's so happy. They're like, they're like oh, oh yeah, there's a cool rocket. And then they're like, <gasps> what is that one it of didn't the take long for the rocket to begin breaking apart before falling back to Earth and exploding. How? What the heck? What the? Oh no. meant to happen. Findings from later found that the failure was likely due to an emergency shutdown of the booster's engines and about 17 seconds into takeoff. Okay. Luckily, the rocket was unmanned, but it was carrying 600 tons of highly toxic kerosene, amyl, and heptyl fuel, no, which was spilled all over the surrounding area. While the fuel did give off a poisonous smoke, it was partly contained thanks to nearby rain at the launch site. 
Unfortunately, the people of Baikonur, a town about 36 miles away from the launch, were still in harm's way. An alert went out telling them to stay inside with the windows closed until further notice. The rocket was insured for 6 billion rubles, which comes out to about okay. 182 million American dollars. The failure came on the heels of a videos, rocket just launch kind of down below. to occur in yeah. Russia. Three yeah, satellites were lost yeah, in December like, of 2010 when a different proton. You might be watching more other videos on this. After this particular incident, um, all proton rockets had to be grounded for months until a detailed investigation could be carried out to try to prevent future disasters. Number three. On January 17, hmm? 1997, a rocket that went by GPS IIR-1 was set to be the first block <laughs> IIR GPS satellite to set flight. It was supposed to operate as a component of the United States Air Force Global Positioning System. It's a but good day. It's a good day. It's a good day. It blew apart day. only 13 seconds after it took That's off. Brilliant. You can see how quickly Please. things go from exciting <laughs> to devastating in one humongous blast. What is... Oh no, I already see that just a fat rocket. Yep. Mm, that's like the, that's like that's the like a firework. That's one of the under. That's the what world. a good firework is. So that's the best world's best firework. Look at that. Mm. But what if what if there were um? That's a firework you would see. What if the there was, there was other like nukes in there, so it was the supposed to like, explode in there. Um, in the sound space, the so it breaks well, well, that's, that's... The flight termination system was activated via its onboard computer. This detonated the explosive charges located around the rocket, causing it to go up in flames. When it exploded, the rocket was roughly 1,600 feet in the air, making yeah. it the lowest altitude explosion to occur at Cape Canaveral since the Atlas oh. Centaur AC-5 disaster in 1965. Later, an investigation found that the failure was due to a crack in the casing of the number two solid rocket motor. This crack began to form at T plus six seconds, and it only got worse from yeah. there. At T like plus twelve, it would seconds, suck. The SRB and that's why you're taking a risk as an astronaut. It might like explode, but that's like a little risk. I'm gonna risk in a, for Anna. Uh, actually, I paused the video so I could talk about something. Just um, pause it. Okay, resulting if, in debris if, getting stuck at the number eight yeah, SRB right next to it. That led to the well, motor failure. What he said. Debris getting stuck at the number eight SRB right next to it. That led to the motor failing, and at that Those point, have a ton of no oh, hope little of tiny the baby mission. rockets. A manual destruct yeah, command was set to terminate the launch for safety reasons. Residents of the surrounding area were advised to stay inside and keep their windows closed because vapors from the rocket could be toxic or irritating. Okay. The impact was still felt in the nearby town. Some damage to store windows were reported as much as 10 miles away from the launch site. But buildings were repaired. Who cares about, who cares Luckily, about store nobody windows? nobody was killed from this incident. Okay, the Vanguard T-33 was the United States' first attempt to get a satellite into orbit around the planet. The world well, saw several successful satellite. Soviet launches cool. with Sputnik 1 and 2, so the United States designed the Vanguard TV-3. This like, was a small like satellite a made to test the launch abilities of the three-stage Vanguard and study the effects of the Earth's orbit on the vessel. It was also meant to obtain geodetic measurements through the orbit's analysis. The key words in that last sentence are meant to. The launch was set to take place on December 6, 1957. Just two seconds after liftoff, the rocket began to lose thrust. It fell back to Earth onto its launch pad. As it settled back onto the ground, the fuel tanks ruptured and subsequently exploded. The rocket was destroyed and the launch pad sustained extreme damage. There were a number of failures during the year, and the United States promptly announced them. The first and most spectacular of these was Vanguard. That should have not Hold exploded. Up. Hold up. How, first, wait. What, it, like? During the year, and the United States promptly announced them. The first and most Oh, I know how it exploded. It hit the ground. No. And the, it went. The engine, no, the they, fire. They said the engine exploded. Take off, but trouble occurred either in the second or third stages. 
An investigation it's ensued, crazy. but they could not determine the precise cause of the accident. It's Imagine watching it, thinking you're going to see something really cool. Some way. After the incident, and it the satellite was too Next late. video, we're, we're going to be reacting to However, creepy it videos. Went on to be mm. it, but the just tell us what Space you want in the comments. In the yeah, we we could. But we're going to be opening on um, some Pokemon packs and um, soon. Yeah, soon. Was supposed to be launched from the Shichang satellite and what do you call these cards again? However, if you don't the satellite know? Itself was oh, yeah. The and we're going to be opening Yu-Gi-Oh packs more. too. If you guys want to watch that, just subscribe. Yeah, like and subscribe, so... Because it's heading in the complete wrong direction. What's this creeping stuff? Remember to share this video with all your friends? Mm-hmm. Later in the video, that you see like the rocket sparkly. transforming into a fireball before crashing back to the ground. That's probably what this is the dinosaurs. You know that Mega Tsunami? Is that, I bet you that, if you've seen that video yet, I, if that crashed into the water, that's probably gonna cause it. Water. Just go on my channel. That, that destroyed the whole entire, the whole entire, um, city or country or something. In Earth, thing, not Earth. Thing. It's like kind of wiped out like a whole time. The rocket ended up crashing in a nearby village where six people lost their lives, according to a Chinese report. However, estimates that came out of America suggest that the number could be much higher. A video crew later went to the village where many buildings were completely destroyed. An investigation took place afterward, which determined that there was a failure within the rocket's guidance system. The investigation forced the Long March Rock program to greatly improve its reliability. The program did not experience another failure until 2011. However, the parties involved with the disaster did not get out of it unscathed. Mm -hmm. The investigation like led to a huge political controversy in the United States. The Nobody US even cares about this. Conducted its own investigation, what do you which found that information like from the report them. had been given illegally. No, nobody cares about the thing that was on my chair. Space Systems had to pay twenty million dollars to settle charges of violating export dollars. controls. Rocket launches are necessary to support our mm -hmm. modern. Those day spaceships are However, good. Because they're like airplanes, the you can like ensure the they'll go off without a hitch. Mm -hmm. Same. All space organizations can do is learn from these mistakes and try to make sure future disasters don't have a chance I'm to happen. for you. Be sure to click the link on screen to check out five okay. ship. Okay, we're we're gonna well, end the video there. Don't. Don't forget to like and subscribe the video.